It's been a crazy month. I haven't recorded or uploaded anything for about a month because I have been moving and I got a new job that has crazy hours, has me up at like 2.30 in the morning to get there at 4. It's just been crazy. But I've been getting a lot of, not a lot of requests, I like one or two requests on videos of how I do my makeup. So I'm yeah. I'm getting ready to work up here and I thought I could just record a quick video of how I do my makeup. Let's get started. We're going to be like a real tutorial today. So I wanted to actually um, instruct you how to do your makeup. I'm going to wipe my face off. <laughs> face off. It's a movie in a show. Um, I'm also doing it with individual lashes on because it's actually harder to do it like this. And I want people to know that's how I do it. First things first. Eyebrows. So with these, I usually underline first. And I do like weird face angles, but I can't see that well. So I'm using a very small mirror with two times zoom in it, or whatever it's called. And then I go to the tail to find my tail, how I want it to go and everything. I kind of like the, I like arches, but I like doing the short tails. But sometimes it's a good trick to do it like this, just push it up, underline, and then brush down. Top of your arch to the bottom of your tail. Line the top of it. Sharpen over so your hairs are going the same way. And just define the tail and carefully go towards the center of your face. So go under the eyebrow. Over the tail. Just go on top. So I'm just gonna blend this in because I don't like it when it's like stark like that. Now for the part you came here for, probably. I'm taking, I mean, today, <laughs> me some Dream Street by ColourPop and Caffeine Lights. In this color, for my face. Probably like a foundation, you're laying the foundation of the colors that are gonna go on top of it. You can take a very, very light pink and not super pigmented color and put it on top. It'll look fine. It's kind of like a primer for my eyes. Instead of using just a primer, I'm using this. I'm using Spark for my crease color. I'm gonna put this right in my crease. You can see that it starts off really light, and I like it kind of brighter. So that was my crease color. This is the Stardust. I like you using brighter colors and colors that really pop because it looks good on my skin tone. You need to find colors that are good on your own skin tones. What work for me are like reds and pinks for my trans my crease colors and then lighter colors like golds and colors like stardust on my lids. And a nice transition color in between. So with potion, it's gonna have a transition right here. For a long time, I used Kylie palette. Um, I used to use like three colors. It was like orange, a 
a really light, I just used the burgundy palette. So it was orange, it was like, I guess a golden tan. I don't even know what the color was, but it was really pretty on my eyes. Then I used a brown to like have it transition a little better. I'm gonna, and then I did that for a long time and I did the burgundy color for a long time, like the burgundy tan and brown. And it was just kind of boring, I guess. And I found out that gold really looked good on my eyes. And I discovered burgundy is also really good because I used to use burgundy all the time too. I'm using Sweet Dreams. I'm putting this right over that really light color I had. Give it a little bit of a shimmer. I'll push the brown color. And take this brush and sweep it up. And since I am done with my eyeshadow, here's what I do to get it off of my eyelashes. Let's go like this. It's pretty simple. It doesn't always come off all the way. So what I do is just take some eyeliner. First I put the eyeliner on my lid a little bit. Just align it. I take the eye liner. Then I just do this. Make my eyelashes black. Sometimes when you're just doing your makeup like this, strips are easier. But I get tired of buying strips and I was too lazy to put them on every day. Right. So eyeliner is going back on. Then I just take my colossal the Colossal Volume Express by Maybelline Eyeliner or Mascara. I can't think of words today. And I just sweep these up. This is my look. This is how I do my makeup pretty much every day for work. At least I have been for the past week. Hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something. I will be doing more videos, especially when I'm actually moved, because right now it's just like a transition phase. I hope this was recording, because if it wasn't, I'm gonna be really mad. Also, I might be off angle. I think I'm actually right here, instead of right here. Oh my god! Oh. Wow, it was recording. Okay, bye!